Hey, good morning once again, everyone. Um, let's get started again with another uh, three minutes with God. Uh, still coming from again uh, Psalm 100. So let us go ahead and start the clock. So uh, Psalm 100 verse 2 says, Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Uh, just first off, we see... Uh, the command to serve the Lord. Um, and uh, honestly, looking at, uh, if we look at Romans uh, 1, 1 and 2, that, you know, serving God is is the absolute least that we can do. Um, and serving God and giving God myself is, uh, is honestly the only thing that we have to offer. Because when you think about... Uh, any money that you have, cars, clothes, uh, anything that we can actually give God, uh, it's all his already. So uh, Psalms 50 tells us that God owns the cattle upon a thousand hills. Um, so me, myself, that's the only thing that I can actually give God. So I'm, I'm going to serve him uh, with gladness. Look at this. This is, this is attitude. Um, and as you begin to serve God, we have to serve God with the right attitude. It's all about, it's all about attitude. Um, and, you know, one thing that we cannot have is a bad attitude and, and serving God and being um, ungrateful and, and, and doing it uh, grudgingly and pouting and complaining as we're serving God. And uh, that's one thing that we cannot do. And that's one thing that God will not accept. Uh, so the Bible tells us to serve the Lord with gladness. And then it tells us to come before his presence with singing. Now, when you think about this, um, that uh, the Bible is telling us that, that we are uh, able to come before his presence um, and when you when you really sit down and, and think about that, that is an amazing thing because when you when you realize who God is and uh, that God is the one who created everything, that God is the only one who is from everlasting to everlasting. God is the one who has picked us up, who has turned us around, who has uh, placed our feet on solid ground. God is the one who has opened the doors for us. God is the one who wakes up wake us up every morning, and to know that this same God wants us to come into his presence. I mean, that is a, that is a big thing to know that the one who created everything that we can see, feel, and touch, uh, it invites us to come into his presence. That is, um, uh, that is not a small thing. Um, uh, and we're, we're to come into his presence with singing because uh, as we uh, know that the as they are singing around the throne room, even now, holy, 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 Lord God almighty, the heaven and earth are full of your glory. And as we get ready to wrap up today, I leave you with this. What is your attitude as you serve God? So God bless you and have a great day.